Welcome to Naraisai Technologies, this is Ramchandar. In this video, I am going to discuss about program on java.util.arraylist constructors in Java collection framework. Our concept is program on java.util.arraylist, program on java.util.arraylist constructors in Java collection framework observe here. Mainly in ArrayList, we have three types of constructors. Mainly in ArrayList, we have three types of constructors. One is ArrayList of zero argument, another one is ArrayList of int argument, another one is ArrayList of collection. Now, clearly observe guys. Whenever we creating an object for array list by using zero argument, by using zero argument, initially capacity is what here 10. And what is the fill ratio or load factor? What is the fill ratio or load factor? Very simple. Fill ratio is 3 by 2. Current capacity into 3 by 2. Nothing but half will be increases. Now, array list of int, here whatever the numeric, whatever the value we are written here, that value become a initial capacity. For example, in the place of int, I written what here 8. So, my initial capacity is what 8 only. Whenever we adding 9th element, whenever we adding 9th element, what happen in the time? automatically size will be increases. Now, in this time, what is the size here? In this time, the size will be current capacity into 3 by 2. So, nothing but here current capacity 10, 10 into 3 by 2, nothing but 15, half will be increases. Here, 8 into 3 by 2, 2 4s are 8, 4 3s are 12. So, capacity is what 12. Now, whenever we adding 13th element, then automatically size will be increases into 3 by 2. So, like this keep on increases. Now, array list of collection, whatever the elements we have in the collection, for example, array list of, array list, new array list of, one more array list I am passing here. Now, that array list size is 12, array list number of elements are 12. So, the new array list object contains what here? 12 elements. So, like this, we have three types of constructors. On top of the every constructor, I will develop one program and I am going to show you the internal, internally what happened in ArrayList with the support of what debugging mode of Eclipse. Now, I am taking here one ArrayList object, one ArrayList object, ArrayList AL equal to new ArrayList. Now, especially my ArrayList is going to hold only integer type data, that is what I am writing here, integer and more and more about this syntax we will see in generic concept. Now, after that I am adding some elements like al dot add of 10, al dot add of 10. Now, I am copy the data, I am pasting here. So, totally how many elements I have? 20, 30, 40, this is 30 and this is 40 and this is 50 and this is 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110, 120. Now, observe. Here, after that I am printing the data. System dot out dot print an AL. Now, I am writing here what your AL itself. Now, let me take breakpoints on top of the every line. 5, 6, 7, 8, on top of the 9, 10, and keep on going. I mentioned breakpoints in all the areas. Let me execute this program, run as 
Java application. This is normal running mode, normal way of execution. But I, I require debug wise, then only we can understand internally what happened. Now, initially, I'm shifting the control to nest lane. Nothing but my cursor is pointing to six lane. Nothing but up to now, five lines are executing. Now, array list object is created and element data, nothing is there up to now. Now, I'm, I'm adding first element. If you're adding first element, observe here, element data, what are those, how many elements are there, how many, how much size do we get, 0 to 9, 0 to 9 means what, 10 elements, the default size is what here, we can able to place how many objects here, 10 objects, okay. Now, 20 I am added, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. Now, now see the capacity, 10 elements up to added, 10 elements added, all the 10 elements in the sequentially placed into what here, all the index position from 0 to 9. Now, whenever we adding 11th element, see the capacity of array list, automatically the capacity of array list will be become a what, up to 14, 0 to 14 means totally, what is the, how many index positions are you getting? 15 memory locations are you getting, are you getting 15 memory locations. So, the default capacity of uh, if you are creating array list with a zero argument constructor, the default capacity is 10. Whenever we adding 11th element, automatically what happened guys, uh, the size will be increases by half 10 and half totally 15, okay. Let us go for second one, let us go for second constructor. Now, what is this second constructor? I have array list. It is also I am taking okay. Anyhow, let me do one thing. In this particular time, I am taking in this particular time I am taking size like 8. In this particular time, I am taking like what here? Array list of integer. Array list of integer. So by defaultly, how many elements are given by how many elements are given by array list here? Observe. How many elements are given by array list? Now, see, this is my args. Now, once we shifting the control to next line, what happened? Array list by default created. It will useful for only holding 8 objects. Now, element data is what here? 0 to 0 to what? 7 only. Now, now I am added 10. 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. Now, after adding 7 elements, the size is what here? Same 0 to 7. Now, I am adding 8th element. Again, the size is what here? Same 0 to 7. 0 to 7. Now, I am adding 9th element. Once we adding 9th element, automatically the size will become a, the size will increases. How much increases? current capacity into 3 by 2, 8 into 3 by 2, 2 fours are 8, 4 threes are 12. So, we will get index position like a 0 to 11. So, automatically the size will be increases up to half. Okay. Now, the one more constructor here is, one more constructor, what is that one more constructor? Okay. Before that, now I am adding one more element also, al dot add of, al dot add of 130. Now, again, now, previously observed, we observe like whenever we adding 9th element, automatically capacity will be 12. Now, I am adding 13th element. So, let me add the elements 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 and 13. Now, see the size of uh, array list. Previously, the size will be 0 to 11. 0 to 11. Now, what happened observe here? 0 to 17. Whenever we adding 9th ninth, uh, ninth element, automatically the size will become a what? 12. Nothing but 0 to 11 index position. But now, again we will get extra 6 index position. So, what is the current capacity right now here? See, 12. But I am adding 13th element, 3 by 2. So, totally 2 6 are 12. 6 3 are 8. Nothing but 0 to 17. So, half will be increases. Now, now let me concentrate on next one. 
let me concentrate on what your next one what is that collection related collection related array list now here i'm taking like new array list of zero argument so by defaultly size is what here 10 only now whenever we adding 11th element automatically size will become a 15 now observe here i'm taking one more array list array list what is this integer array list integer al1 equal to al1 equal to new array list of integer new array list of integer now i'm writing like what al so what is this constructor will do whatever the data which we have in the al entire data will be placed into where you are al1 how many values are there in the al totally 12 values okay now now observe here after that i'm adding some integer values to array list 1 al1 dot add al1 dot add 140 now seriously observe what is the size of al1 that is entirely depend upon what your al what is the initial capacity al1 that is depend upon size of al so let me show you like this then you will get the more clarity on top of program let me execute this program as a debug mode yes now let me add some elements to first array list 1 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 and 11 and 12 elements are added now once some 12 elements are added automatically array list size become what is 0 to 15 0 to 15 initially 0 to 9 only once we adding once we adding uh, 11th element automatically the size will be increases up to half nothing but 10 plus of 15 now how many elements do we have in the al 12 elements we have how many elements do we have in the al 12 elements now we copied the 12 elements from al to where you are al1 now let's check let's check let me creating al1 object let me creating al1 object now let's see let's see in the al1 so what is the size here 12 whatever the elements we have whatever the elements we have al that elements count become a capacity of al1 nothing but how many elements are there nothing but uh, what is the size of al 12 now initial capacity of al1 is what here 12 now let me inter let me add 13th element once we add 13th element automatically the capacity will be increases up to how much of 12 plus of nothing but 6 totally 18 totally how much here 18 see 0 to 17 index positions are showing but how many elements are there 0 to 12 0 to 12 means of how many 13 elements are there no clearly see size is what here 13 size is what here 13 and uh, total capa initial capacity initial capacity 12 only whatever the size we have related to al that will be become a initial capacity of al1 now once we adding 13th element automatically the size will be what increases up to how much 12 into 3 by 2 nothing but 18 so these are the initial capacities as well as load factors of array list of 0 array list of int array list of constructor one more time i'm repeating i'm giving a quick review if you are using zero argument array list constructor the initial capacity is 10 whenever we adding 11th element automatically half will be increases nothing but 10 plus of 5 15 will be become now whenever we taking array list of int here i'm taking initial capacity is what 8 whenever we adding ninth element automatically array list capacity become a 12 8 plus half half means 8 half means 4 8 plus 4 12 now array list of collection in the collection if you are adding array list if you are placing array list the size of the array list the size of the array list become a initial capacity of newly created array list now here al size is what here 12 al size is 12 that is the initial capacity of what here new array list is al1 now whenever we adding 13th element automatically newly created array list initial newly created array list capacity will be increases up to how much 12 of nothing but 6 12 plus 6 18 so this this is the internal story related to array list initial capacity as well as what load factor i hope you understand what happened internally by using debugging mode for more videos please subscribe
नरेश आई टी चैनल थैंक यू